Welcome to our in-depth exploration of liberalism, a key theory in international relations that emphasizes cooperation, democracy, and the importance of international institutions. In this video, we'll delve into the core principles of liberalism, its historical roots, and how it influences global politics. What is liberalism? Liberalism is a theory of international relations that posits that states can achieve mutual benefits through cooperation, guided by shared values such as democracy, human rights, and free markets. Key principles of liberalism include the promotion of democracy, protection of individual rights, the importance of international institutions, and the role of economic interdependence in fostering peace. Historical Roots of Liberalism Liberalism has its roots in the Enlightenment, a period of intellectual and philosophical development that took place in Europe during the 17th and 18th centuries. Key thinkers such as Immanuel Kant laid the groundwork for liberal ideas, with his essay Perpetual Peace arguing that democracies are less likely to engage in war with one another. The modern application of liberalism in international relations can be traced back to US President Woodrow Wilson, who advocated for the creation of the League of Nations after World War I. The League, a precursor to the United Nations, was an early attempt to establish an international organization that could mediate conflicts and promote peace. Liberalism in practice, today, liberalism is visible in the establishment of international institutions such as the United Nations, the World Trade Organization, and the International Criminal Court. These organizations promote cooperation, enforce international law, and facilitate dialogue between nations. Economic interdependence is another key aspect of liberalism in practice. By fostering trade and investment between nations, economic ties can act as a stabilizing force, reducing the likelihood of conflict and encouraging collaboration. Liberalism also plays a role in promoting democracy and human rights around the world. Through diplomacy and international institutions, liberal states work together to advance these values, aiming to create a more just and peaceful global community. Criticisms and limitations, liberalism has its critics, with some arguing that it is overly idealistic and underestimates the role of power and self-interest in international relations. Realists, in particular, argue that states will ultimately prioritize their own security and interests, even when cooperating within international institutions. Another criticism of liberalism is its tendency to promote interventionism, as liberal states may feel compelled to intervene in other countries to protect human rights or promote democracy. Such interventions can sometimes lead to unintended consequences and destabilize regions. In conclusion, liberalism is a significant theory in international relations that emphasizes cooperation, democracy, and the importance of international institutions. By understanding the principles of liberalism, we can better comprehend the forces that shape global politics and strive for a more interconnected and peaceful world. For more in-depth explorations of other international relations theories, check out our videos on realism, constructivism, Marxism, dependency theory, and feminism. By understanding these theories, you'll gain a comprehensive view of the many factors that influence the complex world of international relations. If you enjoyed this exploration of liberalism in international relations, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. Don't forget to leave a comment with your thoughts on liberalism and its impact on global politics. We'd love to hear your perspectives and engage in a meaningful discussion. See you next time.